On the fourth day of Christmas, Rob Top gave to me Ultra Lines by Xander Game, Sharp, Miner by Giron Anu, Cataclysm by Riders, and The Lost Existence by Jonathan GD. How's it going, everyone? And welcome to the fourth Demon of Christmas. We are going to be doing Ultra Violence by Zender Game, which is a very popular level that came out this year. When it came out, uh, I knew it was really awesome and I was going to play it then. But I decided, you know what? I think this deserves a slot in the 12 Demons of Christmas, so I've been saving it for now. It looks fantastic. I'm super pumped to play it. And because it is one of the easier levels that we're going to be doing in the 12 Demons of Christmas, I'm going to be playing it blind. I'm going to be playing it in normal mode from 0%. And I'm going to see how far I can get without practice. We're just going to do the whole shebang all in one go right now. Chaos, destructions, fears, pains. A new world shall be reborn. Sequel to Field of Memories. The Apocalypse chapter begins. Ooh, that sounds ominous. This level definitely has some Christmas vibes to it as well. Ultra violence. You know, people going after those Boxing Day sales. Get pretty violent sometimes. Ultra violence by Zender Game. Let's go. <laughs> Ultra violence. Activate two shit. Okay. Don't quite know what happened there. I'm experiencing a, li a little bit of lag, but that's okay. Just a, just, just a tiny bit. I can barely notice it, really. Okay. Look, look, see, look at this. We don't need... Oh, boy. This is an e it's one of the easier levels of the thing of the 12 Demons of Christmas, so... Whoa! Okay. I started clicking buttons when I didn't have to. You got to wait a little bit there. 14%. This level looks really cool so far. I haven't been able to read the words, what they're saying, because I'm too busy playing. But, you know, I bet it's really cool. Oh, you got to go down three times there. Okay, so you kind of, like, jump up twice to reach the top. And then you get... Yeah, no, and I... I got it! One, two, one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Holy, I'm upside down. And then it's a spider part. I'm getting... I see how this flows. It has some nice music sync as well, right? The UFO uh, presses are like the dun 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 dun. Is Zender Game always has really good music sync? Like there is going to be a boss fight here, and I think Zender Game has really good music sync, like for like the boss attacks when they pop out. So I'm pretty excited. I love this kind of like it's it's a super futuristic look, but it's also like very colorful. It's not like super bleak. It's 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 really cool. I love Zender Game's levels. They're just they're all fantastic. Yeah, you got to hit like a green uh, jump orb in there and then fly up. Okay, that's neat. Oh, 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 I see how that flows. Okay, are we going? Was so something about sound? Ooh! I, wow, I went so far there. Oh, you gotta hit the switch to move. Oh, it's unlocked that, yeah. Oh, now we're in the boss fight. Okay, you gotta follow the uh, the Orby Orb. That's so cool. That's such a cool concept. I love it. It's like an animated way of just, instead of just putting like arrows, you actually gotta follow the orb. Oh, that's, that, oh, hold, that's, that's, that's really cool. I'm so, I'm so down for that. What a dynamic way to have, like, indicators on a boss fight. This boss fight looks insanely cool, by the way. Woo! You will die out soon. No! No! Don't go away, Orby! Man, those boss attacks look so cool. Holy crap. Bum, 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 bum. God, I, okay, I love the music singing Zender Games levels. They're so cool. And they just flow so good. The level just, like, flows so good. Bump, uh, bump, 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 as you're going up and down there. It's, it's, God, I love it. <laughs> oh, and it goes to the music so well, like the screaming sound in the song. It's so good. So this part's really cool. So you can't go too fast. It screams. You go up and then it screams again. And then like you, you turn to the ship. That's so cool, dude. Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't know what's going on. I don't know. Oh. Oh, oh my god, those attacks were so much fun, and then you get eaten! That's the ultra-violence! Eating someone else is definitely ultra-violence if you eat someone. I'd consider that. It's not just violence, it's ultra-violence. You went, you crossed the line from violence to ultra-violence when you eat someone. Wow, that's insanely cool. I'm gonna have to practice one more time. But, oh boy, that is an awesome boss fight. It flows really well. It's clear where the attacks are coming from, but it's also a challenge. Like, it's, it's just so well put together. Damn, dude. It's so good. Okay, I don't think I have the last boss fight down, but we're going to give it a shot. Like, when I've gone in practice, but I just kind of, like, lucked out. I, uh, I don't think I'm going to be able to beat it when I get there. We're going to die. Even before we get eaten. Okay, I got that part now. Can I remember this? Jump. No. Yeah, you got to have you gotta have a little bit of composure there. There we go. Got it. We're going to the boss. The first form, anyways. 
Oh, no, never mind. <laughs> totally forgot about a section. Don't die here, Eric. Okay, now we're... I'm not going to forget now. There we go. Now we're at the first boss. Okay, I'm going to follow you, little guy. I wish you helped me out more. Ah, ah! Oh, 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 oh. It, man, th those boss attacks look so good. Dude, they look so good. What am I doing? I almost died there. Holy crap. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Ooh, this is such a cool part. Boom. Boom, 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 boom. Mm, mm. Okay, we're going to the last boss fight. This is going to be nuts, though. Come on, let's do it. Let's do it. I just what happened? I where? Did you, I think I teleported the top again when I wasn't supposed to. Up oh, poop. Last form. Whoa! Hey! There is a beam. There's a beam up there. Which means I win, by the way. That's a g getting eaten's a good thing. I wanted to receive the ultra violence so I could be the victor. <laughs> that was a cool level. Um, I definitely had to practice the ending a little bit more though. Uh, but once I did, I understood it a bit better and I was able to do it. It's fantastic. I think uh, the gameplay in this level is really fun. Like I said, it's easy to see where the boss attacks are coming from. The part I found the very hardest was after the last laser attack that comes around, it goes up to the top and then comes back down, but then there's like these other shots, these like fireball shots that get shot at you. And then it's like hard to tell exactly when to go up to dodge the laser and when to dodge those fireballs. I don't know, for some reason, it was playing mind games with me. It's probably not even that hard, but I just couldn't wrap my head around it and I died there like a lot. That was probably most of my deaths at the end. Um, But yeah, fantastic level. Uh, it didn't take me that long to learn. 148 attempts, which is pretty chill for a medium demon. I really, really liked it. Definitely think it's medium demon difficulty. And yeah, it's a great addition to the 12 demons of Christmas. I mean, I don't really need to talk too much about the level just because, you know, this level's super popular. A lot of people already know about it. It's just another awesome boss fight Zender game battle where the music syncs up perfectly to the beautiful looking attacks, by the way. And the bosses are so animated. Like the bosses take up the entire screen and they're so big and menacing, right? It's really, really cool. Really, really awesome stuff. So Zender game, don't know if you're watching, but you make awesome levels and I really enjoy playing them. So this and I played Dreamflower recently as well are just like, mm, they're so good. There's so much fun to play too. They're not just beautiful looking, they're fun to play also, which is awesome. It's like, it's this perfect mix. It's, they're so good. Well, this is the fourth demon of Christmas. It definitely was easier than the last three levels that I've played. The next demon, the difficulty, is going back up. It's going to be a pretty tough one. Leave a thumbs up down below. I'll see you in the next one. And as always, peace.